Unfortunately, atrocities against people are probably as old as civilization itself. But the good news, in my view, is that technology now offers the opportunity to protect people's human rights, to identify atrocities, to bring those responsible to account. Microsoft's partnership with the ICC is, in fact, one of the most important partnerships we have with anyone anywhere in the world. Why? It starts with the critical role that the ICC itself plays in pursuing human rights abuses, investigating them, bringing people to justice. AI is potentially a game changer for the investigation and prosecution of human rights violations. And the ICC is at the forefront of harnessing the power of AI. The diversity of evidential streams represents a problem and an opportunity. It's from satellite, it's from cell site data, the internet, social media platforms, Facebook, TikTok, the list goes on. The quantum is so vast that one has to use artificial intelligence, cognitive services, and uh, e-discovery tools to be successful. The ability of artificial intelligence and machine learning to spot patterns is an incredible 99% accuracy. It's way beyond what can be achieved with the human eye and an ability even for the most accomplished prosecutor and the most experienced investigator to do alone. The targeted use of artificial intelligence, machine learning tools, and ensuring that it is intertwined in all of the activities of the office of the prosecutor is absolutely essential in order to bring justice to the most vulnerable people of the world. And this is why the relationship with Microsoft is so essential. It's a relationship built upon shared values. It's a relationship built upon trust to build a better world. We are at the beginning of a new era of AI and for technology to protect human rights. And it's why we at Microsoft are so devoted to using AI so that we can innovate and really identify and pursue the new breakthrough ideas that will make this better protection of human rights, not just a vision, but a reality.